we are keeping our community healthy by connecting them to health insurance, food, and community resources. Right now, the partnership is working closely with the Live Well Arizona incubator teams to make sure that we're continuing to provide them with support as they work to make their communities healthy places for all of their residents to live. We're working to keep Arizonans healthy by trying to inform our policymakers, whether they're elected or appointed officials, the evidence base for the interventions that they're making related to the COVID-19 pandemic. We're interested in evidence-based public policy. We're keeping our community healthy by getting out and enjoying our streets at a safe distance and inviting people to do so with us and reclaim their streets as places for people. We are keeping the community healthy by continual online connection, especially we do a lot about mindfulness exercise like this. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. We are keeping our community safe by providing um, life-saving emergency shelter services to any individual experiencing homelessness as well as families. We have additionally opened uh, more hotel space so that we can try to get folks that are um, in our community but are medically vulnerable, senior citizens, that sort of thing, so that they can have somewhere to go and quarantine so that we can prevent potentially them getting sick. We're keeping our community healthy by engaging our students still. Um, we having to do a lot of things on video live chat, but we're having conversations about self-care, um, how to take care of ourselves during these hard times. We're also working with our students to figure out ways that we can give back and meet the needs of our community. Um, we're just really trying to take care, um, stay connected, and uh, keep stay positive. So um, I hope everybody's uh, taking care, stay at home, and we'll see everyone soon. Bye.